we had a viewer who had asked a question can i use nebulizer for my young child my doctor had advised for it but my neighbors are saying no it will be addictive don't use nebulizers what is the truth behind this let us see the answer in today's video hi friends i am dr karamat this is scientific doctor channel in this channel health related explanations particularly queries raised by you the viewer i have been answering through simple videos if you want to see such videos kindly subscribe to this channel also if you have any such queries kindly put it in the comments below i'll try to answer them in subsequent videos today's video is about nebulizer use and the myths surrounding it i have already made videos on wheezing and asthma and nebulizer use but let us see what is nebulizer is it addictive we have to understand there are methods of drug delivery so whenever we take medicines it can be taken like a tablet or a syrup which are taken orally you can take it via injections okay the injection can be into the muscle into the blood vessel below the skin into the skin there are various methods of injections and you can take these medicines via into the rectum into the nose into the eyes into the ears so there are various methods of delivering the medicine one such method through inhalational route is either via nebulizer or via inhaler so this is a method of drug delivery so the question of addiction doesn't rise because this is not the drug this is only a method there is no addiction potential for the method of nebulizer or for inhaler for that matter there is no addiction potential for the drugs used via these things the same drugs which you are using via nebulizer or inhaler are also available for oral use or for injectable use so there is no question of increased addiction when you use it via nebulizer or inhaler you can no you can have this question in mind okay if the medicine is available via injectable or oral route why should i take it via nebulizer or inhaler logically if you think if i take a oral medicine or an injectable medicine it has to go into the stomach get absorbed processed in the liver go via blood stream go to every damn part of the body and some part of it will reach the lung where it is required but if the medicine is required in the lung i am taking it via inhaler or nebulizer it directly reaches the lung so the risk of side effects is less the action is quicker so it is beneficial to take a medicine via inhaler or nebulizer certainly not addiction forming or have more side effects so this is very clear which should you use nebulizer or inhaler this will entirely depend upon your doctors and your own preferences and age nebulizer no has this machine which converts the liquid medicine into a mist which you inhale over a period of 5 to 10 minutes sometimes over 20 minutes for complete action inhaler gives the dose via a meter dose through an aerosol you inhale it within 30 seconds to 1 minute so the action is quicker so inhaler has the advantage of quicker action okay so quicker recovery so you are able to know recover from the illness quickly but the problem is it needs coordination so to circumvent this you have devices like spacers but you still need coordination in very young babies and also those who are severely ill they are not able to coordinate they are not able to inhale properly nebulizer will be of use because here the user involvement is very less you just need to breathe the medicine will go in so the user involvement is very less what are the problems with nebulizer the instrument is bulky it requires electrical current or batteries and it takes longer at least for 5 to 10 minutes sometimes even up to 20 minutes for the drugs to act the orals or injectables will take even longer leave that even among the inhalational drugs nebulizer will take a longer duration for action than your inhaler so those people who can use this coordination and use inhalers probably that is the best 
for very sick individuals or for very young babies nebulizer is suited so whichever suits yourself with your doctor's advice you can very well use there is absolutely no potential for addiction or anything any side effects extra side effects for use of nebulizer you can conveniently comfortably use these things for drug delivery without any worries if you found this video useful kindly share it among your friends and relatives if you want to see such videos kindly subscribe to this channel till we meet again bye